Hey guys, today I just want to tell you about three great programs and one great site. The site is kind of just more like a fun thing that will last like one day, really. But first is Rocket Doc. Rocket Doc is a great app, is a great program that lets you, well, most people already know what it is, go from applications to like media coders, just like the icon of it and everything. But it's great just having it like right here. I'll put the link in the description. I honestly, I do use it every day. Most people do like Duncan from Mobile Phone 2003, people like him. But uh, if you have Vista, it probably came with it. It's a great, it's a great program, and you'll use it probably pretty much every day. The other one is Pimp My Search. I got this from a YouTube video. It's kind of weird. It's it doesn't really like does anything to Google, but watch. Let's put in AJ. Let's go to create now, and there you go. It just has a it has my name. You can put any name you want to into it. I think like it can be as long as you want it to. I think. And the next one is Skype. If you don't know what Skype is, it's a free internet service that lets you talk to anyone that has Skype. Now, to call actual phones, it's a little fee, but I think like it's a lot cheaper than actually having a phone service. But this is the actual program. If you want to add me, mine is AJ Wendell, all lowercase. But as you can see, I have a lot, most people from Mob3 who have Skype. But yeah, it's a great service, and I use it a lot when I want to talk to people by not calling them because they don't have their number because that'd be kind of weird. The next is um, if you ever just wanted to take your iPod songs and take them from your iPod. Normally, iTunes doesn't allow you to do that, but this program here it is. Normally, you have like when you have your iPod pu uh, plugged into the computer, it comes up, but it has all your songs. You can click to add all your songs or just selected ones. It takes them from your iPod and then you have them on your computer, so you can just add them back to iTunes, and there you go. Now you can take any song you want to, it, and your iPod still works normal. But yeah, these are three great programs and one great site that I use every day except for this site. I, it's just more of just like, I don't know, just a fun little thing. Thanks for watching you guys. Subscribe, rate, and comment my videos if you liked it.